Well, good morning. I want to thank you for calling me today. You've reached the insane chef. After the tone, leave me a message. I don't. You motherfuckers have a good day. Hey, Chef, this is Rufus, your new sous chef you just hired. Hey, this old boy just showed up here with a semi-truck full of toilet paper. You know, a bunch of ass wipe. Said your old sous chef ordered it. What the hell you want me to do with all this shit? Call me. Go well, burn my biscuits. Today, I'm tired as hell, so we're gonna make a very simple country style meal all up in this motherfucker. Join me, shout y'all, and it's a very inexpensive meal. Now, now, today. So I got Smithfield ham steak here, $3.55. That's a big old steak. That's a giant skillet there, so that's a big steak for three fifty five. dollars Feed your whole motherfucking family with this shit. It's cheap. Potatoes. Canned potatoes for $0.50. Cents. A little butter, salt, pepper, and garlic in there. And you got yourself a nice little side. This thing's making a big mess, so grease splattered everywhere. So I'm gonna have a big cleanup at the end of the night. So next thing we had in here tonight, I got some two strips of bacon left over from breakfast the other day. Yesterday, I guess it was. Crumbled that up in here. But I uh, had one piece of shallot left, one clove, threw that in there, threw a clove of garlic in there. I'm gonna put some uh, pepper and some a uh, little bit of Italian seasoning, and we're gonna have a nice other little side dish. And all this shit will add it up at the end. It ain't costing much. And there we go. Some black pepper, a little Italian seasoning. Be a fantastic dish. Let's turn the fire on there. We can heat that up. Good to go. These smell so southern and so damn good. See what? Cooking these reminds me of being over at my granny Mary's house when I was a child. Last thing I'm going to do is add a little of this better than bouillon in here. Just a little bit. Cause we didn't have no salt. This will be our salt in this. Kind of stir that in there a little bit. Get your ass in there. Get your ass in there. Better than bouillon. Get your ass all up in there. Get in there. All right, there we go. Let's give that a little shake. Ooh, that smells so damn good. It smells like you at home in the south. A uh, skillet seared ham steak. Going in, looking delicious. Got some croissant rolls, and these were a dollar. Sometimes I like taking them and twisting them like so, like you're supposed to. But other times I'm going to show you a trick. You just cut them across, like in the can. You take them out of the can, you cut them across, and when they puff up, you get these little pinwheels, the nice little croissant pinwheels. So that's kind of cool to do. We got green beans. This is uh, my grandmother's style green bean. Absolutely delicious. Mm, smells so good. It's going to taste so good. And them green beans were 44 cents. I used two leftover pieces of bacon. I used a uh, uh, garlic and a shallot clove I had left over from a while ago and needed to use up. A little salt pepper. Italian seasoning. Actually, we didn't put no salt. We put a little of that better than bouillon in there. And these potatoes were 44 cents a can. Slice them down, a little bit of butter, salt, pepper. Good to go. Easy, simple meal. Only other thing I could have done, I could have, uh, if I had some coffee, I don't have no coffee made, but if I had coffee, I would have made a little red eye gravy for this. But I'll show you all that in another video. So that's easily enough food to feed a family of four. If you got four people at home, no problem. You can even stretch that to five or six if you need to. So. Ham steak was, I think, three fifty-five, three fifty-nine, something like that. Around three and a half bucks. The uh, croissants were a dollar. Green beans were forty-four cents, forty-nine cents, something like that. <clears throat> the rest of the stuff was left over, and a forty-four cent can of uh, potatoes. So all together, we spent like five or six bucks. I mean, where else can you go and feed your whole family of four motherfuckers for fucking five, six dollars? You ain't getting that out of McDonald's no more. I guarantee. 
So, I hope you enjoyed this kind of film. This is just showing you how to eat on a budget. Very simple, easy, southern style meal. Thanks for joining me, and we'll see you next time. Heck yeah, there we go. Mr. Chef's already got uh, Christmas plates out before we even had turkey plates. That's Mrs. Chef for you. She's always in the Christmas spirit.